luckily after we got that goal, we were able to bunker in and finish out the game. Was it a bicycle kick? Uh, it was probably like a half, half bicycle kick. Had you ever scored a goal like that in such a... Uh, I've scored yeah. a bike, but not in a game like this before. This was just completely different. Just a uh, high school game? or uh, An academy game a couple years ago. Okay. Yeah. Is the bicycle kick, in general, that's kind of a high-risk kind yeah. of uh, play? Or? When it comes off, it looks really good. When it doesn't come off, it kind of looks a little dumb. So luckily it came off immediately. Did Zach kind of Zach got a foot on the ball and kind of popped it over? Uh, yeah, I don't even head. remember exactly how the ball just popped up. I just remember seeing it in the air at the last second and reacting to it. So. What, uh, Brian, how would you describe kind of yeah, I mean, obviously the whole team is very excited. Um, we have a little bounce, a little extra bounce in our step, um, but we're gonna enjoy it tonight and just turn the page tomorrow. And because they're still unfinished business, um, we gotta go to the College Cup and uh, make our mark. So. When you come to Virginia, do you expect to go to College Cup? Is that one of the reasons? Yeah, I mean, coming to this school, I mean, historically and. They have a very great tradition um, of always making a run in the playoffs. Um, and in the beginning of the season, we talked about that. We want to leave our mark um, because we want to add to the history of this program. Um, so final four, that's trying to go for it. What did you think the uh, of UConn? I mean, were, were they like kind of what you expected coming in get game, and, and game plan for? Or? Yeah. All week we've been watching video. Um, we know they had two great forwards, big bodies um, that we had to double down on. Um, and I mean, they were everything we expected them. They were a great team. Um, they moved the ball well, and the two forwards held the ball up really well, so it made it difficult for us. But um, we packed it in. We did uh, really well defensively. Shut those guys out, and then just did our thing offensively. So. You got a great cross from Darius on your first ball. Was that just a question? Yeah, Darius did all the hard work. I mean, he played a great ball all week in practice. He's been really well for us holding the ball up and uh, getting those crosses in. So we crossed the ball in and we, all week in practice we've been making good runs in the near post. I did that and just it was a matter of me just being in the right spot. There just didn't work. How important was it to get that, that first one, did you think? I think it was really important. We wanted to set the pace early, um, first 15 minutes to set the pace that we were here, that we were the home team. For the home team. Um, we wanted to send a message that we're not going to roll over. So um, it was really important to get that first goal. Well, the team is obviously creeping now. What, what's different about maybe the way the team is playing now than it did in September? I think in practice we're really we just are really energetic. I mean, typically teams in the end of the season they're lackadaisical or they're mentally or physically just exhausted. I think this team is very we're just we're just getting started. I think we're very energetic in practice and um, it's showing out on the field. I'm surprised George said this the first game all season he didn't get any subs. Do you guys have plenty of extra money at the end? Yeah, I think I mean. The good thing about this team is we have a lot of depth, so anybody who comes on the field will do good for us. I think it was just a matter of the game um, and dictating that we were used to this, uh, this pace of the game and that we wanted to just remain active with that. You have not only